Ekta Parishat, this is a mass movement based on the Gandhian principles of non-violence that mobilizes people at grassroots level with campaigns and actions and has been fighting for justice this way for 20 years. An action that is going to take place in India in 2012. The philosophical framework in which this action is going to be to be put is that uh, a strong faith in the power of the poor. The poor people can really make a change. What is important is to convert the so-called weaknesses into strength. Then we will realize poor people are very, very powerful and they can make a change. The second part is our strong faith in young people of the world. That the young people can bring about a change. Young men and women can bring about a change. So faith in young people and the poor can be the base for building a very, very strong national international movement to challenge the present paradigm of development and exploitation, corruption, injustice, etc. etc. <laughs> to bring about any change, you need a critical pressure. It's almost like saying that if you want to boil the water, you need 100 degree heat. So let us not think that this is an Indian action. Maybe the main action is going to be in India, but an action that will trigger an impact across the globe and will be able to bring about a change. So it's almost like moving from a global social forum to global social action. So how do we make this a world level action? The realization that between violence and silence, rather than opting for violence or silence, opt for active non-violence. Now this time this is going to be Jan Satyagraha. Satyagraha is not uh, one action, it is it's an ongoing action. It's a fight for truth, a call for truth. Our generation has a responsibility to change today. Otherwise, the future will not forgive us. The future generation will not forgive us. So take the responsibility and act together. That's it. Thank you very much.